Hello my dear students, welcome to Baiju's exam prep. Hope you guys are fine. So guys, let me tell you, we have got another round of vacancies, but this time not for ISRO, but for DRDO. Yes, you got it right. Apart from ISRO's bumper vacancies, now you have vacancies for DRDO, 181 vacancies. And here you will be given the post of Scientist B. Next, coming further, let me quickly tell you about the number of posts in each disciple. What is the method of applying each and everything? So, let's be quick, guys. Let's be quick. So, first of all, let me tell you uh, that this, if you want to know in detail about the advertisement, you can go to the site of HTTPS. You can, the, you can see it here, uh, the double dot slash rac.gov.in so you can go to this uh, to go to this site apart from that if you talk about it uh, let me quickly tell you about the pay scale pay scale is exactly same which you had it in isro uh, you'll be given level 10 after the seventh pay commission your salary basic pay will be 56100 they have told that apart from uh, basic pay hra dearness allowance and all the other allowances so at the time when you join so approximately when you join for the post of scientist b approximately you will get a roundabout salary of rupees 1 lakh per month okay uh, depending upon the present metro city rate now coming further now coming further uh, let me quickly tell you regarding the vacancies so electronics and communication engineering for under reserve we have 19 ews 5 obc 13 sc 8 and st4 this counts to total 49 vacancies here everything is same same in a sense here you have in every of them you have to have a first class bachelor's degree in respective disciple okay mechanical engineering you have total 44 posts computer science engineering 34 posts electrical engineering 5 posts okay and 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 material science and material science engineering 10 posts physics chemistry is also there chemical engineering is there aeronautical for civil, we have only two posts, but yeah, nevertheless, we have posts, but here it's slightly disappointing because for civil, you have posts only one for OBC and one for SC, okay? But uh, the selection criteria here will be based for shortlisting of candidates will be based on your GATE score. Now, if you'll ask me that, ma'am, is final year students eligible? Yes, you are eligible provided you get a provisional degree. They're not asking for your final degree, but if you get a provisional degree by 30 first august 2023 then you are eligible okay next coming further next coming further about the age criteria so for unreserved it is 28 years for obc it is 31 years and for scst it is 33 years okay last uh, let me tell you regarding the selection criteria in uh, quickly but before that if you talk about uh, can any other person apart from indian nationality can apply no only indian national can apply for this post Third, if I want to talk about, if you want to register for it, you have to go to hwts dot slash slash rac dot gov dot in. Here you can register yourself, login ID, password, so that time to time you can see what are the coming updates. Last but not the least, if I talk about uh, regarding the process of uh, how the shortlisting will be done. So first of all, 80% weightage will be given to your gate score and 20% weightage will be there for interview. Shortlisting of candidates for interview will be in the ratio of 1 is to 10. That means for one seat, 10 students will be called for interview. And final selection will be based on the number of vacancies. Okay. Online submission date, if I talk about when you have to submit because registration fees is 100 rupees. SCST candidates or women don't need to have to pay even that also. And this 100 rupees is non-refundable. Closing date for this is 21 days from the date of activation of online registration link. So online registration link has not been yet here. So the moment it starts, 21 days after it will get closed. More or less similar like we got for ISRO. 5th May approximately it was released and 24th May it was closed. Okay, the link was closed. So around about same you have it for DRDO. But the only thing is pay scale is same. If you talk about the post uh, ISRO you were getting scientist C. Here you are getting scientist B. Okay, apart from that maximum things are same only. Talking about here, uh, ISRO has, con has conducted se uh, separate paper also like CPO have released it vacancy. So they are conducting separate paper 
here it's about gate so gate, they are giving weightage to your gate scorecard now you might have one doubt so let me clear that some students are like uh, uh, ma'am we have electronics engineering but you have electronics and design something like that so um, they have mentioned also if you are an electronics engineer if you are filling what are the further permutation and combinations which are accepted so you don't need to worry about that so let me quickly tell you that also everything else screening shortening as i told you is written i have told you in brief okay now let me quickly tell you okay so like here you can see electronics and communication so if you have only electronics engineering electronics and telecommunication only telecommunication industrial electronics everything is valid here similarly for mechanical like if you have plain mechanical then also it's okay if you have mechanical and automation mechanical and production every permutation and combination it has been mentioned it's applicable here and at the last they have also mentioned any other relevant disciple with qualifying degree which mentions mechanical as the main disciple that is also valid here similarly if you go for computer science or if you go for electrical material engineering every every way they have mentioned the physics chemistry is not for us uh, but chemical engineering aeronautical engineering civil engineering everything like civil civil and structure civil and environment civil and rural everything is given to you okay so if you have main component civil you can apply for this post however for civil it's disappointing because you don't have any post for under reserved category but uh, for mechanical electronics and all you have a bumper offer this time like uh, if you have scored pretty well in gate definitely you should fill this uh, form okay as soon as the registration links get active and prepare for the interview okay so this was the information guys if you have any other doubts uh, doubts please let me know in the comment section and thank you everyone and for more uh, other coming updates subscribe to byju's example thank you everybody